the flat courts. So yeah. here we are, I'm playing a fantasy game today on, on Father's Day. Yeah. So I'm playing my vampire camp, of course, because I don't have any enough orcs and goblins put together. And I'm playing against, well, orcs and goblins. So we've got a whole line of stuff. Okay. Wolf riders, boars, biggins, boys, black orcs, a couple chariots, some more wolf riders, a couple mango swigs in for fun. And well, I, I really hope I'm he lined up enough where I couldn't get my vampire behind him, so he's kind of hiding behind the building. No, so, no, 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 no. I was rolled in the first horse. Right, you know, you know, no, yeah. I get a plus one. I don't know. Oh, yeah, you do. Yeah. Sorry. I lost the one. Okay. Let's do uh, right out of three. I got a two. So I guess I'm going to need to go first. Let's right see right what happens. Uh, so, we'll get him. Two. So, my unexciting turn one. Everybody kind of moved up a little bit, trying to stay out of charge range. Over here, I raised ten zombies right in front of the boar boys, trying to slow them down. And everything else was out of range, and he canceled all my other raised deads trying to get more zombies. So, bottom one. So, end of bottom of, end of turn one. Of course, the war boys wiped out the uh, zombies, and I didn't dispel anything, rolling a whole bunch of ones, and I killed eight grave guard with the play. So, going on to my turn two. So end of my turn two over here. I was able to charge here, but I got a miscast, so and I killed two boards from the miscast plus, and took one on the necromancer. I killed one of my own guys, but uh, only won combat by one, so he held. And that took all my magic to get the Van Held off over on that unit. And so my last unit everyone else can handle, and I did yeah, raise a couple of these guys back. So going so so on to bottom of two. End of my turn, uh, end of turn two, and it was a really bad turn for me. The Mango Squid did a whole lot of damage, uh, killing 11 out of those 20 Crypt Ghouls. Uh, these guys all charged over here, evaporated any Crypt Ghouls, but at least I got a couple of wounds back. Uh, the Goblins charged over here, um, but I lost nobody, and we pushed combat. So my turn three. I swear, one of these games, I'm going to have a good game with my Vampire Camp. Um, over here, the Goblins killed all the Black Knights. Um, just some really great rolling over here. Over here we push combat, and that was the only spell I got off was one Van Hells on that unit. Nobody came back. So, yeah. Going on to uh, bottom of three. Wow. So, end of turn three. The Crypt Ghouls provided the speed bump I wanted, so they're sitting right there. Over here, I, he was able to pass leadership yeah. again. And like everything it, else is just kind of hanging out waiting to do some damage. So, my turn four. I love the way their augments are with you. Absolutely nothing I can do about those. Yeah. If I can't charge them, there's nothing I can do. So they're just going to rape me, and that's exactly what happened. So we're going to call it the end of four. Um, these guys fought. No, actually, it's the middle of middle of four. Um, vaporized most of that unit, and they'll just vaporize some ranks alone next turn. I did manage to get one unit to run away, um, but that was all I was able to do. The zombies failed to charge. And I didn't get a single spell off, so yeah, that was another crazy turn. So yeah, there's just nothing I can do against these guys. Just like killed, got my units down to nothing before I even before anything even happened. So it's gonna be a really big loss for the Vampire Camps.